direction of motion of the dog makes an angle theta with that of the cat. So here I think the diagram, you can see that a little bit some correction I'll make it. So here actually the cat will have velocity u and this is the velocity of the dog. This is the dog. This you put it. Okay, this should be the exact diagram. Some dotted line, I'll bring it. So this angle is what? Theta. And this distance is R. So it's asking now the find the magnitude of aggression of the dog at this instant. <laughs> Okay, let's go back to the uh, sm small introduction of, uh, once again, I think we have to go back to the circle idea. This is what the axis, no? We take it, and what about the velocities? We know this will be a normal. And how the tangential velocity? Tangential velocity will be somewhere like this. And, and what about the omega? The direction of omega will be in this direction. Let me write V. This is the symbols what you are familiar V. And let R be the radius. So what are the formulas we know? V equal to R omega, A n equal to V square by R, omega square R, or also we can write V into omega, no? And look at that, how omega and V will be directed. How that omega and V will be directed. So if you shift this omega, the vector will come here, no? If you shift that omega, the vector will come here. Shall I, shall I bring omega bar here also? I'll, 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 you're supposed to do imagination actually. So I'll, I'll introduce all this one. So this is actually three dimensional area, no? So this is a n. <coughs> yeah, let's bring that one. So these two are how a n and b should be perpendicular. So I, I'm just taking help of this one. Uh, if the velocity is like this, huh? Yeah, we'll, we'll, we can make it. This is a tangential velocity, this is n, so this should be 90 degrees. Take it x, this is y, this is y, and this is z-axis. I'm just taking shifting property of vectors. Can I, can I shift it here? And this is the direction of omega, no? So make all co-initial vectors, v bar, a n bar, and omega bar. Co-initial vectors, they will get aligned like this here. And what is an n equal to v into omega? That that acceleration is what is asking. Actually, you should have said radial acceleration or central acceleration. As they are moving with a constant speed, so no question of tangential. That's why you called <coughs> only acceleration. As the speed of the dog and cat are constant, as the I'll, I'll give the reasons now why there's no tangential as the speed of dog and cat. or constant, so no tangential acceleration. But if the direction is varying, it's continuously what happens as the cat moves, the velocity of the dog also will be directed towards C, so it will rotate, no? So therefore there's a change in direction of motion. So there's a relative motion. So because of that what happens, there is a centripetal acceleration. So how to calculate that one? So what I do is like, I'll dissolve this U sine theta. I'm not going to do anything very big. I dissolve U sine theta. I'll resolve one component of velocity. Uh, best problem it is where student has to uh, what all he learned know that basic he should apply properly. So this is u sine theta. And this is the velocity v bar. And this is r no. This you take this is a cat. Uh, tell me like a <coughs> Uh, omega u sine theta by r will give angular velocity. 
will give angular velocity and what is the direction of that angular velocity should be it should be like this omega relative can you remember yesterday we discussed so what is omega relative is equal to now u sin theta by r then what is the tangential what should be the normal acceleration the normal acceleration definition should be equal to v into omega relative so this should be equal to v u sin theta by r as it is zero so you can also call this as total acceleration nothing wrong go the idea no you have class no 7:30 at i'll class stop the class huh? you have to go attend chemistry no okay thank you all of you Sir, thank you, sir. Thank you. Ah, yeah. Sir, in the exam, in some question they ask T A R I N, sir. Tarin. What is that, sir? Which one, ma? Some questions are very tricky.